Hey, good afternoon, everybody. I am Brian from Third Coast Ministries here on Monday, July 27th to give you a ministry update. So for this ministry update, I'm going to give you a tour of the website. In case you haven't seen it yet, I'll show you what we have going on with projects, new pages that we've created with the online fundraising platform, as, as well as all of our social media contacts and ways to get a hold of me personally here as a missionary in Nicaragua. So stay tuned. Here's the website, thirdcoastministries.org. Welcome to our website, thirdcoastministries.org. Here you go. And as you can see on the homepage in his name, 1 Peter 4.10, as each one has received a gift, minister it to one another as good stewards of the manifold grace of God. So basically, that's what we are all about as the ministry, Third Coast Ministries. We have different gifts, and we're trying to utilize those gifts as good stewards of the manifold grace of God to help those around us. So let's get on with the tour. This is, of course, the homepage. If you don't know how we started, click on About Us. You can see our approach. This is actually a picture from my classroom when we had exams. And then it goes on to talk about my very first trip here in uh, Oz. Yeah, it was end of June, <laughs> end of June, end of June, early July 2017. Uh, my first trip was to Revis. You can read more about it here. It was with my church, Sci Fair Christian Church. If you want to learn more about them, you can click on this link here. And I got some photos from the first trip. So that just goes through. You know, here's us drilling, talks more about the people that I met in the community, the two ladies that were taking English classes. And this kind of talks about how I got my. TEFL certification through the International TEFL Academy. You can click here or click here. It'll take you to their page if you are interested in doing that. And uh, of course, at the bottom, call to action, what now? Thank you for taking the time and you can help support us by clicking here. So one thing I want to show you before we get started is we're on pretty much as many social media platforms as we can be. So if you click here, LinkedIn, this goes to my personal LinkedIn. So I just started updating this little by little. So you can see more about the teaching aspect and professional aspect of the ministry on that page. You can click on this and go to our Facebook page, Third Coast Ministries. Here is a picture of my sixth and seventh grade class from 2018. And there you go. You know how Facebook works. All right. And on Instagram as well, most of the stuff we, we post, we go to Instagram first because it's the easiest with pictures and whatnot. You can see projects, project failures, food, important things like water filters, work, having fun, doing more work and projects, teaching, more work, <laughs> more physical work more teaching, more English practice, all of that here. And one note, on the website, there's not an icon for YouTube, but we are on YouTube as well. Third Coast Ministries, this is our channel. There's no spaces in the name. You can see all of our videos. We There is a lot of content up, up on here, a lot of English. So it's easier to go to the playlist and you can kind of see what's going on, ministry news, tongue twisters, stuff for classes and whatnot. So there you go. That is the social media. I use WhatsApp if you want to get a hold of me. That's the easiest way. I am currently the only infield missionary for the ministry right now. So this is my personal information. This number is the number I use for WhatsApp. So if you want to get a hold of me, Talk to me about something. There you go. Make sure you put the plus in front of the country code, 505. And then, of course, here's my personal email if you need to get a hold of me. So let's keep going. Let's go to the donations page. And here at the top, you can see the, the main things that we're focusing on, scholarships, 
tools, construction projects, vehicle maintenance, ministry transportation, trying to get a, a newer, more reliable, more economical vehicle, and an intern teaching program that we're looking to start and as well as general donations. So that's at the very top. If you scroll down, here is the information that you're probably most interested in. This is our objectives and just for the, for the handful of you guys that, that are always monthly donating, faithfully donating even when times are hard, a very huge thank you. There's really a small group of individuals that really support the ministry. Everything we have done to date is basically through them. And uh, so if you're interested in helping out and joining the ministry, being a partner, if you want to donate online, you can go to PayPal. If you click on this link, this is the ministry page. You'll see my face with the NCA logo there. And if you want to use Zelle, you need to look me up by my personal email. That way it goes to me and then I move it to the to the ministry bank account. And so essentially right now I'm setting up, you see here Cosbox. I am using that online platform to work with fundraising for our projects. And I'll get into more on that in a little bit when we go to the projects tab. And then down here is why donate. And this kind of explains what we do with donations, what the donations are used for, um, on why, why we're trying to do this. And um, one of the things that I've been trying to, to focus on lately is, is creating a smaller, not a smaller, but I guess a group of partners with the, indus with the industry, with the ministry that donate monthly, something like $10, $20, you know, something that, that we would, in the States we would consider kind of small. And if we can grow that group of maybe 10 individuals donating $10, and then get that to eventually maybe 20 individuals or, or individuals donating $20. That would really help with the planning and the forecasting with projects and scholarships that we can do and things that we can do. And so at the bottom, as you can see, you know, would you consider? Do you feel led? Do you feel it in your heart that, hey, this is something I would like to do? I would like to help Third Coast Ministries help other people become a monthly donor. Man, we would, we would love that. And, uh, but you know, we understand if you don't feel led to donate in that manner, can you share, you know, can you follow us? And then when you see something pop up, can you share our fundraisers, share our notices with, with people at your church, with your colleagues, with your friends, you know, we would greatly appreciate that. That really helps as well. More, more than you think that really helps. So now that's the donation tab. Let's go over to projects. Here you can read about projects and these are the six main projects or initiatives rather that, that we are focusing on right now. Scholarships, tools, repair the ministry vehicle. As you already know, it's got a broken transmission, intern teaching program, construction, and purchasing a newer vehicle. Not a new vehicle, but a newer vehicle that is more economical and so as I have been creating more content, you can see the project link. This goes to a page that is only talking about this. So for example, repair ministry vehicle is a short description. Let's go to the project link. Here is the page for that project. This has all of the information that, that is pertinent to the project. So how we got the vehicle, for instance, repairs that we have made, what finally happened, and then our needs for this project. And so, you know, there you go, more details. And then future plans for the vehicle after repairing it. What are we trying to do? So as you can see here, when we get to the point we can purchase a newer, a newer vehicle, we would like to donate this vehicle to bless someone else or another organization here with the vehicle that needs transportation. In the same way, it was blessed, you know, we were blessed to receive this vehicle. And so let's go back. And here you can see it says fundraising link. So as I create the online pages for the project fundraising, I'll put the links here. 
you can click on that hopefully there we go and it goes straight to the online platform for fundraising as you can see right now we have three hundred dollars of the 2500 raise which is about 12 percent here you can read more in depth about what we're trying to do and this is who we are and then if you want to learn more like hey maybe i don't want to read i want to watch a video as i make videos and put the content up it will be on the page so here you go once again these are these six projects and that's basically the website we have a contact us tab you know everything here it has a form but realistically if you get it get a hold of me here this is the fastest way email or a message on whatsapp instagram facebook or linkedin let's go back to the home page in his name that's what we're here to do we are here to do things in his name to help other people that is what we're about thank you so much for taking time out of your day to watch this this update on the, the website to kind of take a quick tour you know when you get a chance save the website make sure if you're on youtube subscribe to the channel if you're on instagram you can follow us on that or facebook that way you can see what's going on and what we're trying to do and 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 if you can man click on that donate button on the donate tab i would really appreciate it we desperately need help always and thank you again for your time and your support thank you for your prayers and all of your messages that you send to us it is so helpful you have no idea sometimes it gets a little I get a little down and, and I'll see a message from somebody. Hey, Brian, I saw this. You're doing a great job. You're killing it. You know, those kind of things are great. You get a message about how people are praying for us. We love that. Thank you so much. And uh, I hope you guys are all doing well. Your families are all healthy. That's it for now. Adios.